Hello friends and welcome to another edition of Pouring Coast to Coast. If this is your first time joining me on my channel, my name is Taniva. Welcome to my studio. So today I have this beautiful uh, 18 by 36 inch canvas. I've painted the edges of it pearl white and I have this beautiful uh, container of paint that was scraped from another painting and it just created this gorgeous lovely kind of buff metallic color. Um, if you're familiar with the color Mink Pearl from Deco Art, this is very reminiscent of that. So I decided to just go with that and create a palette around this. So that's what we're going to do today. And this is, um, I'm planning on this to be a wandering straight pour. So I'm gonna put my base coat down spread it out nice and even and then I think I'm going to do the wandering pour kind of along this area and planning on leaving a good bit of negative space. So that's the plan. Let's get down to the canvas and pour some paint. Here we are with the colors. So this is that beautiful base color I've got here. That was the scrapes from other paintings. I have bronze from Arteza. I have pearl white from, uh, I think this is Arteza also. I have copper from Blick Acrylic. And then I have iridescent gold from Golden. Okay. I start with a little white here. I think I'm going to the copper. Bronze. Gold. Back to the white. Copper. Appalachian sunrise meets my skin Even with my eyes still closed, I can feel it coming in Golden, golden. I'll follow on golden, golden Golden, golden thing in spring rainbow trout and hummingbird wing golden I'll follow the golden 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 things gold hair gold rings just a little bit. Oh, 
start stretching it out this way and kind of see where things are leading. I'm really loving the contrast here, the white against between the bronze and the copper particularly. Ooh, so pretty. I think I'm not gonna come all the way down. I'm gonna start bringing it back this way just a little bit. Bring it over the edge in a couple of spots here. fairly simple stretch I think because I'm just loving what I'm seeing and I'm not wanting to over manipulate this I think I'm gonna bring a little more weight off of this side and I want to bring a little more weight back this way This is all opening up really pretty too. Just a little more off this side. Actually dump a little bit of the paint. I'm really loving where this is going. Part of me is tempted to kind of bring this off the edge too and open it up a little more this way. Ugh. Sometimes it's really hard to make decisions like this. I think I'm gonna try that. weight back this way. So I keep a little more of that negative space. There we go. Yeah, I think that's it. I think this is a really interesting composition. Um, I'm going to bring you in and show you guys the wet results. Here we are. A quick little wet walkthrough. Man, is this pretty. I am loving the contrast here. All of those beautiful long striations. Check out that gold into the bronze. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? This is stunning. Okay, hopefully I'll get a dry walkthrough in before I have to edit this, but not 100% sure. Here we are with a little dry walkthrough. And man, did this come out pretty. I am loving this base coat color. I think I'm going to have to try to figure out how to recreate that because I'm absolutely in love. 
Love all of these little striations. So pretty. It's really interesting how this pearl white kind of reflects the base coat through it too. Okay, well thank you so much for joining me. I hope you all have a beautiful day.